when to give up map areas. So map control. Okay, let's try map control. All right, map control in, in year eight. I think Coalsign's a really good example for this too. So uh, what is map control and how does it uh, define in Siege? So map control basically just means powers of position. Allows you to take certain gunfights or maybe hold on to certain parts of the map that will help you win the round. Normally those power points, uh, if you look into them, what they mean. They mean like positions where you can just deny plan basically. As defender, a good power point would be like, okay, how can I deny the plan? Obviously, in ranked, it doesn't really come down to that point. That guy's mad. <laughs> He's mad. You know, planting the bomb is super rare in ranked because people just swing all the time, but still, it's always good to have a consistent part of understanding of that. This guy's just pretty far in the window, bro. Didn't even mean to shoot me. That's crazy. Unless I had a Z ping. Unfortunate timing right there. It's fine. I'm just getting everything up. Our team looks lost in the sauce. Everyone's off site. Why can I get on the mozzie cam? Okay, Wait, I have to press three to get on the mozzie cam? That's crazy. Look at the yeah, door left side. Timing. Wait, how are we actually getting kills, bro? What is this? Oh, bad. Look a window. It's all right. Sometimes you get unlucky deaths, but. All that matters is that you win the round. I could care less how I die, but if we win the round, bro, I could care less. I don't like that you hit the press three now. Normally the mozzie cams just auto cycle. Cycle camera groups. Oh, is it this? Oh, there we go. Okay, I got it now. I got it. Alright, it's a 4v1. I'm gonna win this. Win a more round. Who's gonna get the kill, boys? Who's gonna get the kill? Wow, some discipline gameplay for oh never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say. Alright, so now we're moving on to kitchen. We're gonna cook up some strat. Let's do uh let's do Mozzie. Actually, let's do Solus. I think Solus would be a good one. Uh I don't know to, yeah, let's go Solus, why not? So in kitchen, obviously, even though kitchen is the bomb site, but you want to uh, hold other parts of the map. That way you can delay them from getting the site. Because Coastline's a very... It's a very hollow map. It's very easy to get to every single room in this game. So what we're going to do is... We're literally going to roam the entire round, basically. If I need to get back in the site, it's because... My teammate needs help. Or it's like last like minute of the round or something. Let's find the drones. Uh, I'm gonna reinforce this wall and ask me some in case I'm gonna get wallbanged. Personal preference, Jacogs. Coast's gone downhill. It's, just, it's, it's a very old map. Old attacker sided. Alright, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold on to Sunrise and Blue Bar because these are pieces of map control. Normally, you don't want to give the attackers this because if they get control of this, then they have the direct line of sight, right? But if I hold on to these as long as we can, 
It will be good. Looks like no one's actually been one person coming here. Right? Put a claymore on the drone. Captain, can you roam office? I got a claymore outside. Oh, Zoe's actually gonna hit freaking Uka. She opened up the door. No drones. Uka. Uka. Nice. I think she was the only one. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of that claymore real quick. Just in case if I do want to run out there later. Alright, looks like they're taking their vert gameplay. So I'm going to stay in Sunrise. Oh, we don't have anyone in sight. Yeah, I can use in sight, bro. Alright. Yeah. That's the only thing. You see, that? that's the only reason why I would need to come back. Last one's unknown. I would assume he's still above. Oh, he's outside. All right, now that we can do this now. We're gonna do this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, obviously, you know, if I really wanted to win, I wouldn't go this far outside, but, you know. Sometimes you just gotta say, F it, bro. I'm just going. Not too shabby of round. Alright, Penthouse is another good example of map control. So... Okay, let's talk about some ways, like, okay, well... I I'm gonna go Oryx. Actually, I love Castle, though. I like Castle, even though Castle doesn't have the best gun. I still like I still like going him. He's he's a fun operator to go. Make sure I have all the right, the right ones. Yo, that Cade skin is zesty, bro. Oh my goodness. But if you're a if you're a player coming in, you're like, okay, so I know all about this about map control. So how can I like identify which parts of the map? So that just comes within time. I can't tell you, like. A one sh because it's, every map is different. There's no one size fits all. Sometimes you're just gonna have to like sit inside, like Oregon. Oregon is a very like large bomb site. Coastline, you kind of want to roam more. Border, you want to roam more. So every map's different. But you kind of have to think about like, okay, where is the enemy most likely gonna kind of come from, and how can I like disrupt them from it? So let's say if yeah, bomb sites penthouse right, but they like to come hookah side. So I would move one room up and lightly like pencil in like this area of, of play. So then I would shoot drones, maybe shoot a few shots in them, but then come back because that's not my prim primary goal. My primary goal is to make them plant the bomb, but obviously that's the, the whole point of attack. You want to uh, you want to delay them. I can either stop that by just killing them all here or, you know, whatever it is. No one's getting past that door. I'm actually gonna open this up in case I want to run out later. Right. It looks like they're hitting direct because they're not coming to me yet. Yeah, we saw the default cam out here. They're not coming over here. Unless they're coming through the basement. I don't think they are. Uh, I saw your video in Quick Peek. Of course, I will understand the specific keys. Okay, well, the hatch bathroom. I can't. Uh, quick peeking is an action. I can't really show you. You know, I can't. I can't show you, or I can't like. Oh, she dropped. You Got know, it. tell you. You know, if let, let's say you're jumping a soccer ball, right? I can help this guy. Refrag my teammate here. All right. But quick peek, let's say slow motion, right? So 
it, it, quick peeking is all about the exposure of your body, right? So if I'm doing this, right? So creep in, quick out, you move back. So it's like one, two, three, you know, one, two, three, one. Two, you're, you're, it's only uh, it's only three leans. You're one in, one out, and then you use car. You like you're basically just can't like you're. The speed of your character leaning is what makes the quick peek possible. It's not it's not really about the strafe. But you just need you just need to be practicing it. It all comes with that muscle. Yeah, it's the muscle memory is what it is. So you need to build the muscle memory. I can't I can't tell you too much about it. Just gotta go and do it. Play T Han Bomb? Mmm. I don't know to be honest. I mean, it can be helpful, but you know, actually, sometimes the bomb is in areas where the bomb is not supposed to be. So I'd be careful about that because you know, on cafe, on cafe, the bomb is like in cigar. <laughs> so uh, yeah, just be a little careful with that. I just think the best way to is just use copy the game. There's really no way around it. That's why I see just so good. All right, so what's some examples of map control on hookah? Map control for attacking is a little bit different because you have longer scopes, you have utility that allows you to open up walls, so you don't have to necessarily, you, you have to make your own, you kind of have to make your map control sometimes. So let's see. Um, well, obviously we need to get inside the building, right? So we're going to enter in below first because this piece of map control allows me to grenade from below and allows me to pick off any roamers. I have the advantage because I'm coming into the building as an attacker, right? So I have I have the advantage of time too. The, long, the longer, like, think about this. Think about as like the, the middle of the bomb site is like a flower. And every piece of room, every room across it is like the petals, right? The, the longer, the, the deeper the round goes in, the, the more the, pe the petals are going to wither at that point. They're all going to wither. Okay, this guy's in Sunrise, bro. I'm sure I don't. So, like, the longer this Oryx is inside Peace. Sunrise, like, the less he, more likely he's going to die. Where is this guy? He's probably still down here, yeah? And it's one HP. Alright. Coming in here. This guy's in sight, bro. I gotta help this guy. Aqua, low. Yeah, he's just in the door. Yeah, that Warlock just murdered our entire team downstairs. All good. All we needed is we really just need one round. Is Grim uh, worth using? He's the only up I don't have. Mm, in my opinion, no. I don't think you should buy him. <laughs> I think there's just better operators to play. All right, we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna go through office again. You have to gonna go kitchen. Just get inside that building. Work the first picks. I think I'm gonna be the one to try to kill the Oryx a bit faster, so he doesn't kill my entire team. So. Watch my YouTube videos all the time. Hey, appreciate it, gods. You're a Diamond 5, and I'm wondering what are some good tips for higher ranks. You? When you're Diamond 5, bro, you already kind of know. It, Unless it's rank 2.0, I'm not sure what your knowledge is, but it's just 5 stacks and strategies, man. That's really it. 5 stacking, make sure you're playing together. You're not... You know, you're, you're using your team's energy to focus on just one part of the map. Or focus on kills, whatever it is. Just make sure you're making progression in the round. So that's all it is. Whether it's kills or not. 
how to attack consulate perhaps perhaps use cav on defense yeah 100 percent i'm actually gonna go nomad this time oh my god i have the ak <laughs> forgot this is not my account all right it's whatever ak is a bit of a slower fire gun but we got work always watch for the spawn peaks the reason I picked Nomad is because I, there's a, where I'm coming in from, there's going to be a lot of flanks, so I kind of want to make sure I just don't I eliminate that. Uh, they got it. They got a Nomad here, or Orox here again. Okay, the only thing about this is that my whole, like, look at my team, they're all spread apart, so I'm basically a one-man armor here. I hear them in security. I'm just gonna take, take a gunfight here, bro. I'm gonna find the nearest guy. Lost alibi dead, nice. Security. Yo, so one's off site still. I'm gonna be a little patient here. I'm just gonna wait for some kills. Do default cam. It's all good. I should be not getting flanked right now. Air job still there. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'm just gonna make the play and just try to walk inside. One's on the shield. Can you make Vert above the shield right here? Yeah, well, I'm stuck. I want to get flanked, so I'm just gonna do a double. Okay, that's my teammate. All right, he he's kitchen. I think he's right under the sink, actually. I don't know where he is. Watch your dad. In theater. Theater. Can we just take side here? Yeah. Where's my teammate at? I don't have any info where they are. I'm just gonna walk inside here. Oh, I didn't mean to flash him. Just put the bomb. Pop the bomb, pop the bomb, hurry up. Oh, he's bathroom, he's bathroom. All right, they have Vert above the bomb, right? Yeah, we're good here. Yeah, as they're not winning this. GG. Nice. All right. lost that that's crazy well not too shabby i think you guys kind of get the concept of uh the map control though think about think about think about map control in this game like domination and call of duty right first you want to take point point c then point b point b is kind of like the the middle ground right take b and then point a is like the bomb site or like maybe it's like a rooms across the middle but you need map control if you want to progress through the round. If you don't have map control, then every gunfight is going to feel like in hell. So hopefully that helped you guys a little bit with your uh, map control.